Hello, my name is Rizzo and I am a newly diagnosed type 1 diabetic about a month and a half ago. Today's story that I'm going to talk about is just having some eyesight issues, blurriness that can come along with being diagnosed with type 1 and or using insulin for the very first time. So, I just want to start out saying, of course, that if you are having eyesight issues or blurriness, this is just my story. So please check with an eye doctor if you're experiencing anything and get that checked out. Now, my story actually starts about a year ago. I experienced blurry vision for roughly two weeks. During those two weeks, I just thought it was my cell phone or my computer screen usage and wasn't really worried about it even though I'd never experienced it. I really just thought it was, you know, I was really heavy duty on my phone and the computer right before my vision started having issues. So I brushed it off, didn't think twice about it, and moved on. About a month before my diagnosis, I started having blurry vision again. This time again, I thought it was my phone. So I actually went out and purchased a new phone. And along with that phone, I went to Walmart and bought those screen protective glasses. Um, I think they were like 20 bucks at Walmart and just thought maybe I start, needed to start wearing these. Um, again, then my vision went back to normal. I had a new phone. I didn't have any eye issues. I've never worn glasses before or contacts, always had pretty good vision, and again, just brushed it off. Obviously, um, I went into the DKA, ended up at the doctor's office where I was diagnosed with type one, and still at that point, my vision was perfect. It was good, I wasn't having any issues, the day that I found out that I was a type one, but there's always a but. <laughs> so I started taking the long acting insulin, Basaglar, and about a week after taking it, I noticed some blurry vision again. Now this time, everything up close was really sharp, but everything far away was blurry. And then I did that for about three or four days and then something really weird happened. It switched. So then everything far away, I could see very sharply. And then everything that was up close was very blurry. So obviously I let my diabetic doctor know and she recommended for me to go to the eye doctor since I needed to do that now that I was a diabetic once a year. So I scheduled that appointment. So about, I don't know, six, seven days into all of this, um, my eyesight really got worse. Everything was blurry up close and far away. So at that point, I did contact my eye doctor and asked if I could bump up my appointments because there was no, absolutely no way that I could drive. I was having trouble just walking. I was dizzy. I couldn't, um, you know, get my balance, my bearings, it was that bad. So they ended up squeezing me in and I did a full eye exam and I was lucky to find out that everything looked 100% perfect, but my eyes were still blurry. So what I found out and, um, you know, everyone is different, but what I found out was I needed the magnifying glass glasses. Um, which of course are just your basic readers that you can purchase without a prescription anywhere. So what my prescription strength was, is I needed 4.0 readers, which is really strong. Um, they didn't carry them there at the eye doctor and they actually recommended like I could go elsewhere because it would be cheaper and have a lot more different designs and brands and things like that. So I left that doctor's office knowing that my eyes, everything physically looked great, but I just needed to have some time for my eyes to adjust. So I was on the hunt for 4.0s and Walmart, Dollar General, nobody local had them. So 
We actually had to order them on Amazon and really they're pretty cheap. I, my daughter actually ordered them for me on Amazon and I think it ended up being like $13 for four pairs. And she is a sweetheart of course and she just went all out and she got me all different kinds. So this, this first pair, I don't know if you can see, they're kind of this brown, rose gold color and they, I don't know, had this cute little design on them. But I will let you know, I'm gonna take these off for a second. So, 4.0s were great to help me see and they also magnify your eyes. So when I wear these, I mean, my eyes are like 10 times the size that they're supposed to be, but I had to do it. And I wore these, I think for about a week and a half to two weeks long. There's another pair, the 4.0s, in case anyone wants to see what they look like on. Um, they have the black on the top and the blue on the bottom. Again, magnify my eyes also. And then I also have just the plain black ones with the clear on the bottom. So all of them are really cute. Like I said, I think it was 13 bucks for four pairs of them on Amazon. So not a very big expense for you know, the necessity of needing them. Now I did go to Walmart and the Dollar General and they did not have the strength of 4.0, but they did have 3.25 twos and like 1.5. So they do have some of them. They're just usually under that strength of 3.25. So I did find a pair of 3.25s. These were pink, mauve, maroon, whatever you want to call it, but they also had a cute little design. Now these actually only cost like $6 at Dollar General, so rather cheap again, a little bit more than Amazon, but again, they still make your eyes bigger, but you do what you got to do, right? And then I also got 2.0s. Um, these I actually found at Walmart. I think they were like 20 bucks. I really do like them and I probably have worn them for about a week. I wore the 3.25s the longest though. I wore them for like two or three weeks. And then now um, the 2.0s I think I wore for a week. And now I'm back down to 1.5s, which is what I'm wearing. So obviously, um, my eyesight are, my eyesight, I should say, is still adjusting. Um, I am happy though because, you know, again, starting at 4.0s, I went down to 3.25s, now I'm at 2.0s, and then the 1.5s, I guess, now that I have on. And now when I take off my 1.5s, when I'm outside in the sunlight, I can see like the treetop leaves. It's just when I'm inside or if I need to uh, look at small print like my phone and things like that, that I still need to have the 1.5s on. So my eyes are adjusting. I do have another eye doctor appointment um, scheduled in a few weeks. Um, she had scheduled it two months from my first one. And she did let me know that this can take time it is your body adjusting, whether it's just because my blood sugar, my body has like been used to such high blood sugars and now with insulin, it's bringing it down and my eyes need to adjust to that. So she said just to be patient and let it do its thing. So I'm trying to be patient, but it is one of those deals where I wake up every day and I don't have my glasses on and I am excited to wake up and look and see like, Am I going to be able to see normal today? <laughs> so yeah, so that's my story. I don't know. Let me know if you guys are also struggling with any eyesight issues. And if you did have issues, how you dealt with it, you know, were you able to wear readers? Did you not wear readers? How long did it take for you to get your eyesight back to normal? or maybe you didn't get it back to normal at all, or maybe you didn't have any of these effects at all. So I'm definitely curious to know how everyone else compares to what I've been through. So definitely put it down in the comments somewhere so I can see that. So 
Thanks for watching. Again, I'm new type one and I'm also new to YouTube. I want to go through my experiences and share them with all of you because I know I'm not alone out there and you know, just hearing other people and their stories just makes me feel so much better that I'm normal somewhat <laughs> going through this process. So thanks for watching. Don't forget, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.